Selam. In the previous tutorial, we learned the personal pronouns. Well, you can forget them all because in Turkish, we don't really use personal pronouns when we speak. But then how do we know who we're referring to? Well, we use personal suffixes, which is the topic of the session today. Let me share my screen with you. So there we go. We're going to look at an example. Here, we're going to take öğretmen, which means teacher. And as you see, the personal pronouns listed here in Turkish and in English here on the side. And let's see how we add personal suffixes for each personal pronoun. Ben öğretmenim, sen öğretmensin, as you see there is a sound connection, o öğretmendir, well dir is in brackets because it's optional and in Turkish when we speak we don't really use this personal suffix it's just listed in the books and grammar books you will see that but when you speak you can drop it biz öğretmeniz another sound connection as you see siz öğretmensiniz again there is a sound connection onlar öğretmen Lash, another sound connection. Well, as you see, it's pretty straightforward. For each personal pronouns, we have a personal suffix. And with some of them, there is a sound connection. So it is easy. But there is something you really need to bear in mind. In Turkish, we have vowel harmony so here in the example the ending vowel is e so what happens if it's a different vowel like here çalışkan a so there are then vowel variations in the personal suffixes listed here, which I will explore more with you with some examples in the next part. I will see you soon. Bye.